welcome. This is Melissa R. Moose Stock Swash Reviewing DY. So I saw this this morning. Unfortunately, I wish I had done it in the morning, but it had no volume. It had no volume in the pre-market or barely any at all, and then no volume really until later. In fact, let's just see when the volume actually did come into this to be, as I am wondering. Gosh, this, yeah, this, is, this was so thin this morning. This was a good half an hour to the volume came into this, jeez. It, this was unfortunate. This is unfortunate. We could have done this early today and it would have been a much, much, much better day. Now this was, this did ha this did not have the volume in it until good 20 minutes into the open. Anyways, by the time I saw it, I was looking for an entry, it was far away. And then I ended up sending out this to the room. Here was the good entry and got the drop. I said 70 was a target came all the way down, it almost got there. I, you know, I felt confident that it could get there if the market continued down. This was just unfortunate that we didn't get it early and I usually like to get these things early. I don't know why this was so thin. This was earnings. Yeah, I mean, some of these days here I'm seeing now are kind of thin, that's probably why. Yeah, this is less than 300,000. Yeah, that's probably why. Shoot. Anyways, called a late trade, it, trade in it when the volume was there, and it worked. And it worked, and if you did the ad, it, it was a nice drop-in. And I was trying to find something that made sense with the difference between the entry and the stop, because that's where you get the risk to reward. And it wasn't there earlier, and it was too thin. So we'll see what we get tomorrow, but it's, it's a kind of week where you have to pick careful things, and you have to be careful, and... I'm going to be fully aware of that tomorrow morning, but this did work as a late trade today. I prefer the fast trades. I prefer the early trades. This did work. If anybody did it, congrats. You got it down. And again, you definitely should be out of this because the market closes in 45 minutes. So good luck, everyone. We'll see what we get next week. If you're interested in the Golden Gap course, it's June 12th and 13th. Email me if you have any questions at melissa at thestockswoosh.com.